how far did, uh, where are you guys from and what are you, come, what are you going as? Well, uh, I'm from Oklahoma City. I uh, drove almost 11, 12 hours to get here. Uh, I'm going as the Vault Dweller from uh, Fallout 4. Uh, dressed up as my own character from the game. So this is a really cool, really cool thing that I got to do was bring my character to life. Yeah. So I love that. It's, yeah, it's pretty obvious, but... <laughs> Me, I, I'm local, actually. I, I'm from here in Chicago. Um, but <clears throat> my costume is a Wasteland Joker, based off of uh, the Fallout games and a few other uh, dystopia games I've seen. Okay. That's um, really cool. <laughs> all this just came from a little meme I saw online with uh, Joker wearing half the shit and saying, Got jokes. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, how do you guys think the book has been coming along? Y y your book that has to feature Spider-Man. Well, I'm not liking the book, because he's been writing a lot of bad things about me. <laughs> in fact, he's cracking jokes on me like, at my expense, too. Not appreciative of that. I thought I was the joking genius. Oh. <laughs> so you guys liking, liking up here so far in Chicago? Oh, I love Chicago. <laughs> of course, I can swing by here every year so I can get away from the Manhattan monsters. Well, maybe I shouldn't say monsters, but... Well, basically, they are monsters. Yeah, I because they're those villains. I don't know <laughs> See, you should just, like, you know, get paid. That's how you, that's how you make the money. Well, I would have gotten paid if Tony Stark didn't come up with that stupid old superhero registration act, <laughs> which messed up my timeline and my marriage along the way. <laughs> Oh, you also have uh, an Aunt May that's younger than younger than the other one. Oh yeah, keep on hearing about that. And then Tony Stark was hitting on her. Yeah, how do you feel about Tony hitting on Aunt May? Oh, you know I love my Aunt May, but Tony on the other hand, well, he's got his good side, he's got his bad side, but overall he's just trying to do the right thing, you know. So would you want him as an uncle? Uh. More like an acquaintance. <laughs> I don't think I can handle a drinking uncle. Just I already lost one. I saw his rice in the store. So how do you think Cable's going to like being in the movie? Mm, I'm going to uh, probably um, have a lot of bad attitude because I'm going to be probably uh, testing the whole thing. It's almost like the video game. Yeah. Okay. So we have Ursula here, and it's a very good costume. Yeah. Um, so how far did you travel to come to T2E2 this year? Actually, not that far. I live in the suburbs, just about 20 minutes from here. This is the first year, though, we decided to stay in a hotel downtown. Just uh, My husband and I, this is kind of our wedding anniversary we've done for a couple of years, and this is our 20 years this year, so we just decided to do it up. We stayed at the Blackstone last night. And, um, that, that's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> was he, is he dressed up? No, he's, uh, he's, he's actually parked in the car. He's kind of my, uh, my, my assistant to keep me fed and watered throughout the day. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. See, you should have made him come as Prince Eric. Which is, that's basically what Ursula made him do anyway. He's like, uh, thank you very much. Okay, it's the last day. We're just getting here. It's been a long weekend. Very tired. Here's a check for you. Here's a tip for your trouble. Don't spend it all in one place. Oh, that's awesome. I <laughs> I just got a bottle cap. That's awesome. <clears throat> From Fallout. Again, one thing. Love it. <laughs> okay, it's nine o'clock in the morning. We are here. This is the line in front of us. Now we spin around. Nobody's really coming in over here yet, it looks like. But look how much the line has grown since we've gotten here. And it's still going to continue to grow as the droves come in. We're going to get really close together and they're playing Star Wars music now.
picked up for your movie deals and everything like that. I am pretty happy about it. I mean, that's that's pretty rad to get a uh, movie deal, so yeah, that's, can't be happier about that. Are you guys going to have any rights on how the characters are going to be portrayed or anything like that? I have no idea about any of the, the Yeah, I'm not even sure. This is the first time that the, the uh, movie deal has gone this far, so whatever happens next, I have no idea. But, yeah. well, I really hope it does good. It's a really good book. I like it a lot. And, and a lot of independent books don't get the credit they deserve. So I really hope you guys get really far in it. Thanks.